Leaders allied to the Kenya Kwanzaa administration have told off the opposition over its position on the reconstitution of the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission. National Assembly Majority Leader Kimani Shungwa says opposition leaders are out to scuttle the process of recruiting commissioners of the country's polls agency. Azmio maintains that the reconstitution of the IBC will only happen after Parliament approves the NADCO report, that is the National Dialogue Committee report, even after the court directed the IBC selection panel to reconstitute the IEBC. Kevin Mutai with the intrigues. Hili kwena Electro and Boundaries Commission atuwezi kukubalia Kenya Kwanza wa nominate ma commissioner peke yao. Na tulizungumza tukasema Raila na Ruto ni lazima wakubaliane ni nani atakuwa chairman wa IEBC Parliament. The standoff over the reconstitution of the IEBC seems to be far from over. The opposition leaders and those from the Kenya Kwanzaa holding their grounds as both sides maintain their stance on how the poll agency should be reconstituted. <laughs> Kenya Kwanzaa leaders led by the National Assembly Majority Leader Kimani Shongwa claim that the fresh demands by the opposition are not part of the NADCO report and therefore should be met with resistance. The only point of divergence we have with our colleagues in the laws that we proposed there is not a single provision in the law that President William Ruto must consult anybody in appointing either the panel or the commissioners of IBC. They are now accusing the opposition of trying to frustrate the process. <laughs> And for Raila Odinga, I want to tell you, I want to IPC it is not an individual thing. If IPC is not Raila, and IPC is not William Ruto, it is the people of Kenya, and we must follow the law. They maintain their commitment to prioritize the adoption of the NADCO report when Parliament resumes from recess on Tuesday. And if passed by the August House, a new panel will be constituted by Parliament, which will pave way for the recruitment of the IEBC commissioners. And we shall do the best that we can when we reopen Parliament next week to adopt that report, pass all the legislative proposals that we proposed in the report. As new leaders maintain, approval of the NADCO report by Parliament is not negotiable. And if they go ahead and reconstitute the IBC outside the NADCO framework, then that will only be an IBC for Kenya Kwanzaa. The stalemate surrounding reconstitution of the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission has raised fears over constitutional crises. This has delayed by elections in both the ward and national assemblies, such as Banisa constituency in Mandera County, where residents have been without a member of parliament since March 2023, following the death of Kulo Hassan. The report is expected to be tabled when parliament resumes. Kevin Mutai.